So I work in a Christian school, I uh, help run it actually. There's a lot of stuff that we get to do around here and it's a really, really cool setup, a really cool system as well. The students are awesome, we have a good time and it's a lot of fun. Uh, obviously it's a school so it, it comes with its days and you know, Anyways, being a Christian school, it would make sense that we read out of the Bible. We'd probably say our pledges, we pray, and it is a school, so obviously education is huge. All of these things we do, but also as a Christian school, every week we have a chapel service. We have church at the school. We get the kids involved in helping to sing. Sometimes we might get them to MC or to open up. And then myself or another minister, whether it's a guest or somebody that's a part of our local laity will come and preach. Obviously something that is more geared towards the youth and the kids. But in case you didn't know, today is day 12 in a row that I have posted a video like this, a vlog. I'm going for at least 30 days in a row. After that, I don't know what I'm gonna do. This vlog series is pretty much gonna take us into our school's graduation and into the summer. So there's gonna be a lot of cool stuff that we can capture and we can share with you. So we'll, we'll see, we'll see where it goes from there. But as of today, it's a church day at school, chapel day at school, and we'll show you what that's all about. Just to give a rundown of the day, first things first, we open up the school and then students come in. This is just the first portion of the day where they hang out and chill. Students are coming in right now. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and get the first 30 to 40 minutes of this day done. And then we will officially begin with our opening exercises. Spencer, do you wanna say hey? Or nothing at all? Nevea, do you wanna say hey? Okay, <laughs> you can wait. Millie, you wanna say something? Or dab or something like that. Is that a thing? Do people do that anymore? A dab? What is a dab? A dab, like when you do like that. Do people do that anymore? Yeah. They do? <laughs> do you want to do that? Yeah. yeah. Okay, all right, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Once everybody is in and the time hits, we make our way inside and begin class. Starting with our pledges. We pledge to the American flag, to the Christian flag, into the Bible. Then we pray, give a few announcements, and class gets started. I'm in the office, by the way. I'm not just like saying all this stuff in the Learning Center. I stepped out real quick so I could grab these papers and do this voiceover. So I'm not just interrupting class, but I, I, gotta, I gotta get back in there now. We're gonna get through this first portion of the day, and then we have first break. During first break, the students will eat their snacks and just play games, just chill out. Normally during this time, I will jot down notes, just keep an eye on the students or maybe catch a Pokemon or two. I don't know. Just depends on how I'm feeling. On Fridays, however, I make my way to the sanctuary, get everything on and prepared for chapel. It's around 940 right now, so I've got a few minutes to get all this stuff on, get some of the students over here to practice for the worship set, and then chapel begins around 10 o'clock. Now, this video is called Church at School. I've already explained the whole being a Christian school, having church here, having chapel services here, all that good stuff, but I want to explain kind of, I guess, my idea for having a chapel service every week at a school. While we've never gotten a negative response, I can already hear maybe somebody that's watching this video complaining, saying that we are trying to shove Christianity down a child's throat and just trying to make them believe in God and all this, that, and the third. However, um, that's not really the case. First of all, it's a Christian school. Somebody has to enroll in the school in order to be a student here. So somewhere in the mix, the parents, the child, there is a root of Christianity that is in the Christian school. So from the very get-go, nothing is being forced. This is a choice to have Jesus Christ involved in your education. Secondly, as a student, of course, they have to participate in all school activities. That includes attending and being a part of a chapel service, but we don't make anybody sing. We don't make anybody play instruments. They, of course, have to say pledges, and they have to do all of these different activities, again, that just come along with being a student but we don't make them serve God. Do they have to you know, respect his house and everything that anybody coming to the house of God would probably need to do? Then yeah, of course. Nothing is forced whatsoever. However, there is something that we do. We do teach kids that Jesus loves them very, 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 very much and has a plan for them. Why do we do that? because it's true. We also teach the kids that there are right ways to do things 
and there are wrong ways to do things. And this is something that we can for sure learn in the Word of God. And why do we do that? It's because it's true. Our faith and our academy is based on the Bible. It's based on the Word. We educate, we teach, we help the kids, give them ideas for what they can do and what they can pursue in life for a career. But everything is rooted and everything points back to the Word. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm still <clears throat> recovering from all the sinus drainage and everything. My ear's better. Uh, and also, random thing, just in case you were curious, our IDs still have not come in yet in the mail if you've watched the previous logs and you kind of know what's going on. So maybe one day. Maybe they'll come in before the next month. We'll just see them. I'm going to get these screens on, get these kids in here, and we're going to start chapel. A few minutes later. I'm going to snitch on myself too. Uh, pastor came in and we started talking about some different stuff around the school. So I did not get time to rehearse. We're just gonna wing it. We're just gonna do it. It's gonna be all right. I'm putting the batteries in the mics now. And then we're gonna get this thing started. All these labels, all these titles, all the high titles and the low titles, the good labels and the bad, we gotta put all of that stuff aside and say, God, I'm not coming before you as, as an awesome Sam. I'm not coming before you as a worthless Nate. I'm not coming before you as, as, as an intelligent and as a smarter than everybody else Kylan. I'm not coming before you as just this ugly, hideous, no good for nothing Nate Roberts. I, I'm, not, I'm not coming before you as that. I'm coming before you as Sam. I'm simply coming before you as KJ. I'm coming before you as Nate, as a miracle. I am coming before you as me, all of me. The good, the bad, Jesus the ugly, Jesus the stuff that people Jesus like, the, the stuff that people Somebody like. said in Jesus' name. Jesus Amen. Come on, say it like you mean it. In Jesus' name. Jesus. Amen. Now, why don't you clap your hands really, 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 really big. Great chapel service today. My camera died right in the middle of it, but... It was awesome. A really, really good time. After chapel, we will go back to class and get right back to work. These guys are going to finish some tests today, right? And pass them with the hundreds. We're going to we're going to go to the classroom and we're going to act like we're mad, like you just finished talking to us. Okay. And you like expel all of the DJ light. just waved to the wrong side of the phone, by the way. Honestly, the rest of the day is fairly simple. After lunch, they have a recess break, and then I believe we go back into some class time or like a study hall uh, this evening. The girls have a volleyball practice, and uh, and then eventually we'll go to we'll go to formal tonight. So, which will be tomorrow's video. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap that up here, uh, just because I just kind of wanted to pretty much give you guys a little bit of insight. I didn't really get any of the, not not really get, I didn't get any of the worship at all, but worship was a whole lot of fun today. Our girls sang and did an awesome job. The kids sang and had a good time. It was a, it was a good chapel service. If you're watching this, I hope you're doing all right. I hope you're doing good and I hope you know that Jesus loves you and I will see you tomorrow. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.